please meet Shayla. Now, Shayla, she says she'd rather be stuck in detention than spend time with her boyfriend. Oh. Shayla, what's going on? Well, I brought my fiancé here today yes. to tell him that I've been cheating on him for the whole time of our relationship. Oh. My teacher. With your teacher? Yes. Okay. If you're doing with, well, why would you have a relationship with your fiance then? I mean, if this has been going on the whole time, why'd you get engaged to him? Well, Alan and I have been seeing each other for about two years. Yeah. And the time together has been good. But the problem is he's never around. He's always at the office working or on the internet talking to his little buddies. I need somebody that's going to be there for me. Yeah. And, yeah. and you thought the way to deal with that was just to stay after school. All right, I'll let you talk to your boyfriend, but you're engaged to him. You realize when he finds this out, this could be the end of it, right? I realize that. But you, you love your teacher. I do. Yeah. I do. You thinking of going on to college? No, I'm just... <laughs> I'm just no, I... <laughs> oh, excuse me. You okay? There you go. All right. <laughs> I just stepped on his toe. All right, here is your fiancé, Alan. How you doing, Jerry? That's, that's not a good sign. You come out, here's your fiance. She won't kiss you? Yeah, uh, I'm kind of weary as to what's going on, Jerry. Uh, well, think about it. You're here. Obviously, yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, go ahead, talk to him. Alan, you know I love you, and that I care about you, and I always will. But. Our relationship is going nowhere. You're always at the office. You're always emailing your buddies. You're working constantly, and you're never around. And I need some attention. I need someone that's there for me, someone that cares about me, someone that understands me and loves me. And wait, I brought you here to tell you that I've been cheating on you for nearly the whole time of our relationship. No, no, no. <laughs> No, baby, no, this can't be, no. Look, ever since day one, I've told you, if you've had a problem with me, if you've had a problem with anything of our relationship, all you have to do is talk to me. I, I've always come up to you, and I've, I've sat you down, and we've had discussions about what's right and what's wrong in our relationship, and I know you can't be doing this to me. Please there, tell me you're not doing this to me. Alan, Please. There, there has never been an opportune time to tell you. Oh, I, who is it, baby? Are you, are you seriously doing this to me? I've been cheating on you with my teacher. What? Oh. No, no. Bring out the no, teacher. Baby, no. Come on. Say love. What the hell? He's doing this to me? This to me? He's doing this to me? Listen to me. Alan. I don't know what I don't I don't know what you think's going on. But in about six months we're gonna get married. Alan! <laughs> oh. Oh. Honey! Shayla, we've been I... working so Alan. hard for this. Go ahead, what? 
I mean, I don't understand why he thinks Jerry, I mean, he's gonna marry somebody who's gay. What? This is what I don't understand. Listen, lady, the Alice, only thing, the stop, only thing stop. you've been with is the entire rugby team, okay? Yeah, right. I know that for a fact. I know that for a fact, Jerry, because when we were in your class, we used to call you NWF for nympho white female. The entire school knows about you. The Do you think that box of sex toys that arrived was for us? No. What? I know how to please her! The only thing you know how to please her is a pair of battles! You get the hell off of my What? Can you show this baby, baby, baby? Come here! Show her! Show her! Show her! We'll be back! Thanks for watching. Now please approach the bench. The way I look at it, you have two options here. Option A, watch more Judge Jerry. Option B, watch more Jerry Springer. The choice is yours. Now get out of my courtroom. You have more clips to watch. And don't forget to subscribe.